Hey everyone and welcome back to the Rideshare Hub. If you're new here or if you're a returning subscriber and you just, you know, forgot who I am, my name's Dylan and this is the Rideshare Hub. So we make videos all on Uber, Lyft, DoorDash, Grubhub, anything basically having to do with making money. That's what we do here. We make videos about that. And we teach you guys how to make more money. This is just based off experience. We have uh, experts in all these different areas. Anyways, I wanted to make this video just about showing you different options on rideshare rental companies, okay? So I know uh, some people at these companies and you know, just from working on this channel, have learned a lot about these different companies and you know, it, it's even a good question. Should you rent a car or should you, you know, use your own? Also, before I get into the video, stay tuned until the end. We are, I'm gonna do a little giveaway. So for the next video, I'll announce the winner, but um, yeah, I'm gonna give away a free Rideshare Hub t-shirt. Um, you don't have to pay for shipping and handling or anything. Um, but yeah, if you want a free t-shirt, all you have to do to enter, just kidding. You have to watch till the end to see how to enter. Um, but yeah, guys, at 10,000 subscribers, I'm giving away a car, just so you guys know, so stay tuned for that. Um, let me link up my computer so you can see I'm gonna go over eight rideshare rental companies um, for Uber and Lyft drivers right now. All right, so here it is. Eight rental car companies for Uber and Lyft drivers of 2019. The first one we have is Hire Car. All right, so you guys have probably heard me talk about Hire Car before. It's a car share, car share for ride share. So um, these are like normal people renting out their cars. So um, you, if you have an extra car, you can rent your car out on here too and make some extra money. But there are some really cool options. So let's just say, you know, I want to rent a car. Um, oh, I need to sign up. Let me just sign up really quick. So let's just see, let me just type in um, Berkeley here. And let's just say 27 to 20 to 70 dollars. Um, relevance, low to high, obviously, you know, want to get the cheapest car. So, let's see, I can rent a Ford Focus for $32 per day, which comes out to around 200 bucks per week. Um, yeah, I mean, there's definitely some options here. It does look like it's, you know, a little expensive. Um, I don't know. Somebody shared my post. Cool. Thank you, Chris Manola whoever you are. Um, let's just, let's just look up like Los Angeles, um, and see if there's anything good on here. Yeah. 25 a day. So 25 a day. Let's pull out my calculator here. Times seven. That's $175 per week. Honestly, that's not that bad at all. Um, considering all the money you're saving from, uh, depreciation and maintenance you know you're only paying for gas and you can drive up to 500 miles per per day um this this looks like a great option actually um so yeah i don't know what all this stuff is oh for uh seven days 280 283 what's all this stuff oh the insurance fee i think if you have your own insurance you don't need to pay for that um, so yeah, you guys can uh, look through this and check out and see if there's any cars on here that you like. Um, let's just go high to low. Well, let's just say, um, yeah. If you want to rent a Lexus for a hundred bucks a day, you might as well just get a Tesla. Um, <laughs> yeah. Okay, the next one is Lyft Express Drive. So this is a this is a good option. Um, I just also want to preface this guys by saying, you know, ride sh renting a car for a ride share is not for everyone. And, um, if you're only driving part time, I just recommend using your own car because you really need to make a lot of money and drive pretty much full time in order to make up for the cost of the rental. Um, so you're no, you're netting a, a good profit. So this is Ly Lyft Express Drive. Um, this is a great, yeah, costs are covered. So you, yeah, insurance and standard maintenance are always included. Unlimited miles, no long-term contract. I'm pretty sure it's month to month or maybe even a week to week. So yeah, drive more, pay less. So rentals start at 219 in San Francisco or pay as low as $0 with rental rewards. So this one I really recommend guys, if you 
this is great like if you don't have a car and you want to drive full time with Lyft they're basically you know you're at the end of the day you know 155 dollars 155 rides per week that's like an average of 20 something rides per day that's kind of a lot so I mean I probably couldn't hit that but some of you guys can um, 125 that's totally doable and 100 rides is totally doable as well 59 bucks a week 119 a week that's nothing guys um, look at this guy you can be as happy as him <laughs> um, yeah you guys can look through this if you want I won't get too you know into all the details here but um, yeah is Lyft safe that's that's not really like a rental how long can I keep it? No long. Um, okay, so it's only available in certain areas. So if, if you're in here, it works for you. If not, um, what do I need to drive with? Okay, you need to give at least 20 rides per week. Oh yeah, there's a re re security deposit it looks like as, as well. Okay, the next one is Hertz. Hertz car rental. Let's see here. Do, 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 do. Hertz car rental. Yeah, so this one is good. Um, Uber has a partnership with Hertz. So you can actually, um, if you go to Uber and you type in, it'll, it'll give you a prompt to say, I have a car or I need a car. And it'll take you to Hertz. And yeah, basically, um, you know, you can look for cars and any any kind of car you want really um yeah like whatever um i don't know what kind of cars you guys are into mazda 3 i'm down i'll get a mazda 3 or maybe this dodge challenger that's probably not a great car for rideshare although one time my lyft driver did, was driving a murdered out dodge challenger um i don't know yeah i don't know what do you guys want to do? <laughs> um, so that's Hertz. The next one is Fair. I get so many ads for this one. And I wouldn't be surprised if Fair is on this video because um, they advertise on a lot of my videos. So I need a car for Uber in California. So it looks like they have a partnership with Uber, um, not with Lyft, but you could probably use it for Lyft as well. Every car is $185 a week. That's actually good, guys. I know you guys are thinking that's a lot, but if you're driving full, like I said, this is for full-time drivers. If you're driving full-time, um, you could easily make 1500 bucks a week. And, um, yeah, $185 is, guys, that's nothing compared to, you know, you think of it this way. You'll never have to, like, your car won't ever break down, ever. You know, you, you're just literally driving somebody else's car, um, you know one of the biggest costs of being a driver an uber and a lyft driver is um well there's there's two big costs one is depreciation on your car and the second one is the maintenance so with renting a car 185 dollars a week that's um you know that's really good if you complete 70 trips in a week you can earn 185 dollars a reward from uber so all you have to do is do 70 trips and it's free um, just the reward that's a bonus on top of your earnings already that is legit um, yeah I don't know let me let me see what kind of cars they got guys I, I forgot my password so I can't sign into this uber thing for fair but you guys can check it out yourself I, I don't want to take up too much time I literally just I don't know I need to like I forgot my password whatever <laughs> And there's like all these, yeah, okay. All right, the next one is Get Around. Get Around, this is the purple one, I believe. I don't know why I think of it like that. Um, oh, maybe, yep, yeah, there's some purple there. Yeah, it is purple, right. So Get Around, rent a car in San Francisco for five bucks an hour. I do, I thought this was for rideshare. I could be wrong. Oh no, Get Around, I think, does have a partnership with Uber. Um, let's see. Yeah, I'm in Berkeley, so let's just look up Berkeley. Rent a car in Berkeley, five bucks an hour. It's not bad. Um, 
Let me see. Let, let me just sign in with uh, Facebook and then... Oh, here we go. Do, 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 do. Let me just... Let, let's just do a little live chat, guys. Let's see if they respond to me. Hi, Dylan. Is that it? I don't get the chat back? Wow, lame -o. There's no cars in this area. Try zooming out a bit. Okay. Oh, here's one. Oh yeah, sweet, Tesla Model X. Yeah, just let me rent that one for rideshare. <laughs> um, I don't know, okay, there's a bunch in San Francisco. Let's see what they have. <clears throat> Are they all Model Xs? No. They're all model, they're all Teslas? Okay, guys, I'm not trying to rent a Tesla for Uber. Okay, uh, I'll get back to that one. Maven, the next one is Maven. Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, shoot. Wow, there's a bunch. Never mind. Okay, I guess I just need to load. <laughs> yeah. All right, the next one is Maven Rideshare Rental. Guys, my computer's like freaking out over here. Uh, Maven Gig, lease or rent a car for rideshare and delivery drivers. I think this one is like one of the bigger ones. This this one has been around for a while. Um, oh, electric. Whoa, that's actually cool. Cause this way you um, you don't have to pay for gas maintenance or uh, depreciation. So um, I don't know. I might honestly look at the uh, the rental ones or the the electric ones. Yeah, this one looks legit. Who we are, FAQ. Um, let's see if it says anything about rideshare. Um, Chevy Bolt electric vehicle. Yeah, I think you think you can rent the Chevy Bolt. Okay, what is the next one? Canvas. Canvas is awesome. Canvas rideshare. Um, rental. Have you heard of the song Thotiana? No, I have not. <laughs> what is, where is this Canvas one? Have you guys heard of Canvas? Here we go. Simple alternative to car ownership. Drivecanvas.com. Let's pretend I'm in LA, which I wish I was in LA right now because it's really cold here. Um, save 200 bucks by reserving a car available for pickup. Okay. Not right now. Um, four thirty nine a month. Whoa, that's actually pretty good. I want. I like these Ford Fusions. I don't know about you guys. These new ones. Um, cool. I don't know. You guys can check this one out if you want. The next one and the last one is Enterprise. Everybody knows Enterprise. I've rented a car from Enterprise before. I've also done Hertz as well, but Enterprise is big. Um, they do have a partnership with Uber, I believe. Let's just see. Um, business. Rent a car. Let me just see if it's, there's one for Enterprise rideshare rental. Oh, hey, it's the rideshare guy. Um, yeah guys, so, yeah, uh, Enterprise is legit, just go to, U I think you can just go to Uber and then Enterprise, and, yeah, you'll, you'll, you'll find something, um, I think you guys can figure it out, <laughs> you guys are smart, you guys are watching YouTube, but guys, again, these are the eight ones that I recommend, um, let me just, Make it a little bit bigger. This is, these are all the ones. Um, I'm gonna have the links in the description if you guys wanna check any of them out. Otherwise, um, that's pretty much it for today's video. And just wanna sum it up by saying, again, um, you know, take this information and do your research on it. You know, don't just jump into a car rental and then be like, oh, well, you know, I can only drive 10 hours a week and now I owe all this money. Like, make sure, you know, you can drive a significant amount of time per week to make up for the cost of the rental. 
And now guys, it is time for the giveaway of the Rideshare Hub t-shirt. I've already given away six of these. Um, uh, they really like them. They act a couple of them actually um, sent me photos of them in the shirts. So uh, yeah, I'm doing the giveaway. All you have to do is comment below. And all you have to do is comment below saying, I want a t-shirt. If you comment below on this video saying, I want a t-shirt, in the next video I that I'm in, um, not the other creators, but the next video that I make, I will choose a winner for this. So once again, all you have to do is comment, I want a t-shirt. I want a t-shirt. <laughs> and um, yeah, then I might choose you for the free t-shirt. And um, you can be anywhere in the world. So even if you live in Kazakhstan, I will send you the t-shirt to Kazakhstan. All right, guys, this has been another episode of the Rideshare Hub. Hope you guys enjoyed this video so much. You guys are awesome. Make sure to click that thumbs up button. And yeah, see you on um, Monday at 6 p.m. Um, uh, PST, I'll be going live every single Monday from now on. So come join in if you want to chat. And this has been another episode of the Rideshare Hub. See you guys next time. Bye.